will be blasting their horns downtown at least a little while longer. It's been driving residents nuts ever since federal regulators forced the city of San Diego to lift its order for a quiet zone earlier this week. ABC 10 News reporter Jeff Lasky digs into why it's not clear when horns will finally stop. It's relatively quiet and peaceful right now, but that's only because the Amtrak trains are down this weekend for maintenance. But come Monday morning, train horns are once again going to be blaring through downtown San Diego. Heard enough? The people of downtown certainly have. It's been disturbing, annoying, and 24-7. Janet Stoltner lives in a high-rise right next to the Santa Fe Depot train stop. Since Wednesday, she hasn't been able to sleep. It's been intolerable. That's because Wednesday is when federal regulators told the city of San Diego it could no longer use the quiet zone that prevents trains from blowing their horns at intersections. Why? They say they told the city a year ago that there were several safety violations. Since at least some issues weren't fixed, the regulators decided the intersections were too dangerous unless horns are used to let people know trains are coming. There have been four fatalities with trains in San Diego in recent months. Multiple residents told me the trolley drivers seem to try to keep the noise down more of a toot toot kind of thing. But they say the surf liner coaster and freight trains. They start it and they don't let their hand up. In a statement, Mayor Todd Gloria is apologizing to residents. He says the city is working through the weekend with quote urgency to correct deficiencies and bring the quiet zone into compliance. But it is going to take a while. Gloria says they plan to be ready for another inspection by the end of the month. But there's no guarantee federal regulators will immediately allow the quiet zone to return. Stoltner says if she knew it would only be another week or two, she could steal herself for it. But not knowing how long this will last makes it even worse. We can't go from weekend to weekend not sleeping and not being able to function. Downtown, Jeff Lasky, ABC 10 News. We reached out today to both Amtrak and North County Transit to ask about how much control engineers have over the volume and length of their horns blasts. Neither got back to us by deadline.